The Razor Goliath is Chroma is a soft mouse mat with RGB lighting all the way around it. Here's the box, and this is what's inside. Basically just the pad itself. So we now have lighting on a soft, flexible pad. It does this with tubes all the way around it, and it actually lights up nicely. It still has stitched edges, just over the top of the lighting tube. Where the cable plugs in, there's a cable management area, but I don't think it works too well. The cable tends to slap against things. I also found the tubing causes the cable to rub and creates a bit of friction, so I had to put the mouse punchy really close to the pad, which meant it kept it suspended, just to keep it away. And then it was great, no issues. It measures about 35 by 25.5 centimeters, which is a decent size, but there will be an extended version at some stage. The base is a non-slip rubberized texture. I can still move it around a bit, but as you'll see in the gameplay, it didn't move while playing. Here's a look at it with the Goliath of speed. It feels fairly similar. I was able to jump straight into game and use it quite well. The speed is about the same as a lot of other cloth pads out there. That's why it felt familiar. Just a little bit of functionality with the software. You can jump in Chroma Studio with some flexibility and presets, but it's not to the point where you can get cycling rainbow waves, or not that I could find anyway. And there's a brightness option too. To conclude, it's always great to see Razer pushing the boundaries and making new tech. This is awesome in a lot of ways, but I think unless you have a mouse bungee or a wireless mouse, the outer piping and stitching might get in the way. Other than that, the pad feels good, tracks smoothly and looks great, and I'm glad they didn't put any logos on the actual pad. So if you want to RGB everything, and still want a cloth pad, then this is a cool little product. My only problem with it was the cable on the piping, which I fixed using a bungee. Hope that helps, special thanks to Rosa for sending it out for a review, and if you want to help support the channel, I'll leave some links in the description. Subscribe, like and share this video, and I'll catch you in the next.